In this video, we're going to look at managing materials in Revit. First, it might be helpful to talk about the materials that come with Revit. There are several really good materials, especially starting in Revit 2019. There are advanced materials, or PBR materials, which is more closely related to what Enscape uses in its real-time rendering engine. To get a look at these materials that come with 2019, I created this Revit model that has all of them in use. Revit 2020 actually has several more materials that you can explore. If we go to the Manage Materials dialog, any material without an orange triangle in the lower left corner is a new advanced material. All the materials with the orange triangle are considered a legacy material. So these are older in terms of quality related to the render appearance, not necessarily any of the other attributes in terms of graphics or identity for a Revit material. So you can see this particular model has quite a few of the new advanced materials in it. So we'll open this up in Enscape and see what it looks like. I'm actually providing this file with the data set for this course, so you can open this up and check it out for yourself. All these materials come with Revit 2019, but this file just has them all in use so that you can explore them changing the time of day and the brightness and some of the various settings to see what they look like. Now that this is open, I'll just fly around for a minute so we can check out these different materials. Press the letter H to make the menu go away. So here's a nice bamboo material. If you get real close, you can see some nice highlights. Some of the materials have a nice texture to them. Here's more of a matte plywood material, so there's no finish, so it's going to be more of a non-reflective surface. One of my favorites is this mahogany material. We change the time of day just to get a feel for how it looks. I also like this espresso oak flooring material. You can see the highlights and the areas that are non-reflective. We'll talk more about how that works a little bit later on. So you can explore this file more on your own. Some nice brick materials. 